How much more to make a dollar? You have these coins. Which of these sets of coins do you need to make a dollar? Well, let's see, right here we have a dime. And if you remember a dime, a dime is worth 10 cents. So we need to figure out which one of these sets of coins would help us to make a dollar if we added 10 cents. So we know that one dollar is 100 cents. So 100 minus 10 would be 90. So we're looking for which one of these sets of coins equals 90 cents. So here we have one cent, one cent, one cent, one cent, 10 cents for our dime, 25 cents for our quarter, 25 cents for our other quarter, and 25 cents for our other quarter. So let's count. 25 and 25 makes 50, plus, so I'm gonna cross 25 and 25 makes 50, plus 25 is 75, plus 10 is 85, 86, 87, 88, 89. So this is 89 cents. Remember, we're looking for which one is equal to 90 cents. So let's count here. We have a nickel, which is 5 cents. Dime, 10 cents. 75, or sorry, 25 cents here. Turn that 7 into a 2. 25 cents, 25 cents, 25 cents. So now let's count together. 25 and 25 make 50, plus 25 is 75 plus 10 is 85, plus five is 90. So which one of these would help us make a dollar? This one. You have these coins, which of these sets of coins do you need to make a dollar? So right here is one cent, and here is 10 cents. So 10 plus one equals 11. So if we have 11 cents and we know a dollar is 100, 100 take away 11 is going to be 89 cents. I knew that because 11 is 10 and 1, so 100 minus 10 is 90, and 90 minus 1 is 89. So we need to figure out which one of these is equal to 89 cents. So 1, 1, 1, 1, since those are all pennies. A dime is 10, and quarters are 25. 25. 25. So let's count this sum of money. 25 and 25 make 50, plus 25 is 75, plus 10 is 85, 86, 87, 88, 89. Huh, well that's 89 cents. Let's just count this other set of money to make sure. 1, 1, 1, 1 for the pennies, and 25 for each one of my quarters. So let's start by counting. 25 and 25 makes 50, plus 25 is 75, 76, 77, 78, 79. So that would be 79 cents. So which one is equal to 89? This one right here. Now let's see how much these are worth. Well, we have one penny, one penny, one penny, one penny, a dime, which is equal to 10, and a quarter, which is equal to 25. So let's count 25. 35, 36, 37, 38, 39. So this is 39 cents. Well, if I want to get to 100 cents, I know 39 plus 1 equals 40. And then 40 plus 60 equals 100. So then we can add our add-ins together here. We're looking for 61 cents. So I'm going to erase this and say we are looking for 61 cents. That's our total that we're looking for here. So let's count one here. This one is 10, this is 25, and this is 25. So 25 plus 25 is 50, plus 10 is 60, plus one is 61. Well, that's 61, so that, that could be right, but let's just double check. One penny, one penny, a nickel, a dime, a quarter and a quarter. So let's count. 25 and 25 is 50, plus 10 is 60, plus 5 is 65, 66, 67. 
So we're at 67 here, so we know which one equals 61 cents. Great job. Now let's count here. We have 1, 5, and 25. So 25 and 5 makes 30, plus 1 is 31. So I know that 31 plus 9 gets me to 40. And 40 plus 60 equals 100. So if that's the case, we're going to add 60 plus 9. So we're looking for 69 cents. We're looking for which one of these two equals 69 cents. So one penny, one penny, one penny, one penny, quarter, quarter, quarter. Well, right off the bat, I'm looking at three quarters, and I know 25 plus 25 plus 25 equals 75, 76, 77, 78, 79. So I kind of already knew in my head that this one might be too much because it had three quarters, and 75 is more than 69, but let's just double check. This one is 25. This one is 25, we have 10, 5, 1, 1, 1, 1, 25 and 25 is 50, 60, 65, 66, 67, 68, 69. Nice job. Which of these coins do we need to add to make a dollar? So a penny, that's 1, 1, 1, 1. 5 and 10. So if we count, that's 10, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. So this is worth 19 cents. Well, I know 19 is really close to 20, so I need one more to get to 20. And then I need 80 cents to get to a dollar. So that would be 81 cents is what we're looking for. We're looking for which one of these groups equals 81 cents. So let's start here. 25, 25, 10, five, one, and one. So let's count 25 and 25 makes 50, plus 10 is 60, plus five is 65, 66, 67. So this is 67. So then here I have quarters, so 25, 25, 25, five, and one. So 25, 25, 25, so 25 and 25 is 50, plus 25 is 75, 80, 81. Great job. This time I'm not going to count. I'm not going to write the coin values on them. We're just going to count them. So let's look here. We have one penny, a dime, a quarter, a quarter, a quarter. So 25 and 25 make 50, plus 25 is 75, plus 10 is 85, plus 1 is 86. So this is 86 cents up here. So if we're trying to get to 100, we know 86 plus 4 gets us to 90. And then 90 plus 10 gets us to 100. So we're looking for 14. So which one of these is equal to 14? So I have a dime. So 10 plus 10 is 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. So this group is worth 24 cents. And this group is a dime plus four pennies, so 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So we are looking at this amount, 14 cents, to get us to a dollar. We have three pennies. So if we have three pennies, that's equal to three cents. So now we need to figure out how many more cents do we need to make a dollar. Well, 100 minus three gives us 97 cents. So if we're here at three cents, we need to get to 97. So let's count. 25, 25, and 25 makes 75, 85, 86, 87, 88, 89. So this would be 89. Well, 89 and 3 makes 92, so this one should be correct, but let's double check. 25, 25, and 25 makes 75, 85, 95, 96, 97. You have these coins. Which of these sets of coins do you need to make a dollar? Well, let's count. So we have 25 and 25 make 50, plus 5 is 55, 56, 57, 58, 59. So this amount of coins right here is 59, and we need to get to 100 cents. So 59 cents plus 1 would get me to 60, and 60 plus 40 would equal 100. So we're looking at 
40 plus one, so 41 cents. So which one of these is equal to 41 cents? Well, 10 and 10 make 20, plus one is 21. Now let's go over to this one and we have 25, 35, 40, 41. So this one would be 41 cents. So let's close that scratch pad. Great job. Now let's, we have these coins. Which of these sets of coins do we need to make a dollar? So this is one, one, five, and 10. So 10, 15, 16, 17, 17. So I'm trying to count in my head. 17 plus three is going to give me 20 and 20 plus 80 gets me to 100. So 80 plus three is 83. So we're looking for which one of these is equal to 83. So 25, 25 and 25 make 75, 85, 90, 91. So this one is worth 91 cents. This one, 25, 25, 25 is 75, 80, 81, 82, 83. So this one right here is equal to 83 cents. Now let's look here. We have 25 cents plus 10 cents plus five. So 25, 35, 40 cents. So we have exactly 40 cents, which means we're looking for exactly 60 cents to get to a dollar. 50 and 50, or 25 and 25 make 50, plus 10 is 60. And then over here we have 25 and 25 make 50, 55, 56, 57, 58. So right here, great job.